Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Borals and Gorals, thank you. Welcome back to a thing on the internet. This is an end hostilities draft. For sure. Hodge Gulashi, thank you so much for the resub. 18 months. God, they grow up so fast. Yeah, we're definitely taking this end hostilities. Doesn't really matter that it's spoiled because it's. How much are they. Hundred and forty four tickets for this mox? <clears throat> Are you serious right now? Say what Why is it so expensive? I don't know why I would keep that. I have no reason to like I opened a foil lotus um when it was like 400 tickets and I was like oh I'm gonna hold on to this because there's no way it's gonna go down and then I went down to like 150 tickets and I was like oh no that's sad so I really uh, don't feel like I've definitely not taken the seven drop seven drops seven drops fine I'll play it when I have it but not really what I'm looking for um, I do like skull hunter and hate blade both of these kind of move us into Mardu or Abzan, I guess. I guess Abzan is an option. I love that you have multiple different options. There's multiple different um, decision trees. Shut up and take my Back money. up a little bit. Kerwit with two bones without cause. Yeah, I appreciate you, buddy. You are wonderful. Just wonderful. Although I don't take Winterflame, maybe? Winterflame could be good. I mean, it's a gin, not for not for not for seven mana. It's not. Uh, I'm just gonna take party hate blade. It's the same color, whatever. Team or ascendancy. It's pretty good. Could just take Willy Loxodon, or Bloodfell Caves. This set is very good. Usually, I don't draft flashback drafts this frequently, but this set's very good. And I enjoy it. So, I think it's actually Bloodfell Caves. <clears throat> Could take Salt Road Patrol. Is Master? No, not really. Master's kind of. I mean, it's fine. It's a two-one, but like, this is a format where you use all of your mana all the time. Because you always want to flip your morves, or you want to queue up tricks, like... So you rarely have time to spend three mana to, to activate that dude. Yeah, I think it's pretty pretty easy Pony Back Brigade here. Yeah, two drops do trade with morves for sure, but, like, you can get two drops pretty easily. It's not... They're not super hard to get. I do like Swarm of Blood Flies. This card can get out of hand really quickly. Yeah, I like the Windscarred Crag a lot, but I'm going to go with the Swarm here. This is a lot of five drops here. It's one, two, three, seven, five. You are supposed to block more of the Chiefs, that's true. That is a true story. Hey, this is crazy. Block my morphs with your chiefs. <laughs> Off to pick up the wife and child from the airport. Fun times. So have a good afternoon, evening chat. And is any pot? Have a good afternoon, buddy. Have a good afternoon. Or don't. I'm not your dad. What's the hold up here, Magic Online? Did this have shocks or I misremembering? No, this said it had fetch lands. So they did have lands. See, now we can take this Leaving Master. I do like Swift Kick a lot, though. Uh, 
I don't think our creatures... If you're Mardu, I don't think your creatures are going to be that big. If you're Jeskai, Swift Kick is a lot better because your creatures also prowess. You are my dad. I'm your dad. Hey, this is crazy. Oh, uh, I don't think they're that expensive online though, right? I'm gonna go to GoatBots and find out how much they cost on the internet. Wow, is this pack, am I broken? Oh, I think we're waiting on Kalo 58. Okay, time's up. Mm, probably just taking Jeskai student here. Okay, so let's look at price list. And I'm going to go for, let's look at Polluted Delta. On Magic Online, it's like five tickets. Yeah, you can get a cons Polluted Delta for like five tickets. So, I mean, like... It's not super hard to, to pick them up. You make my night shifts go by so much faster. Sprite of you, really appreciate it, buddy. Thank you for saying so. Valley Dasher. None of these cards are that great. I do like Dragon Scale Boon a lot. We have two red cards and two black cards, essentially. Three black cards. I think it's just Tormenting Voice. Tormenting Voice is actually good. Weapons, Freed Weapon Master. Jeez, take a kill shot. Kill shot is solid rule, so. and then the venerable Lamasu comes back which I mean I, I don't have anything against I will probably play it if I need a playable but I don't love it Oh, McGimp, what up, my dude? Hey, this is Mike. Me. This is baby. I'm coming, baby. Why are these packs taking so long? Oh, seven man is definitely possible. Yep, and then Leaping Master comes back. You gonna finally jump on WoW with WoW Classic? It's not. It's not not tempting. <sighs> How come every time I eat a, a meal, I want to take a nap afterwards? What does that signal? Uh, shambling attendance is good. Yeah, we'll take. I think it's better than the erase. Oh, I can just take this erase. <laughs> Lens of clarity. Look at the look at the f top card of your library and face down creatures you don't control. There's not enough caffeine in my eels. What does that even mean? I have not done any talking about the banned and restricted announcement. I don't even know what my eels are. I'm really tired. I'm going to fall asleep right now. 
or or I'm not gonna fall asleep right now altar of the brood more like shit of the brood <laughs> arrow storm's good there's only five drops though Could audible to I got at least four cards if we audible to Jeskai instead. I don't think it's worth it. I think it's probably just Arrow Storm here. Alabaster Kieran coming back would be nice. I wish we could take incremental growth, but then we lose four red cards. So I'll just take the Arrow Storm. Arrow Storm does hit the face, apparently. That's what I've heard. That is what I've heard. I do like a chief, but unfortunately. We don't have that many warriors just yet. I have like two warriors. Ponyback Brigade and Hateblade. <sighs> Apologies for the yawns. Maybe this guy comes back or the Abazan Battle Priest. I think it's I think it is Chief of the Edge. Oh, another Ponyback. Ponyback is top tier. Yeah, Priest never comes back. There's no reason for it. It's a top tier white card. Windscarred Crag? Yeah, I'm in for a Windscarred Crag. I want my pony back, pony back, pony back, pony back, pony back. Julie's pony back riders. Smite is good, Scared Barons is good, Baringlo is good. I like that Mental Misstep is banned in all formats. <laughs> just like every other, just like every other Phyrexian mana card. Good lord. Oh, I think Rite of the Serpent is great. It's six mana, which is expensive, but still does the job. <laughs> uh, actually, it's restricted. Oh, that's a good point. Ugh. Oh, I guess that's true. Not all Frexy mana cards are banned. I guess that, like, that one that steals a guy isn't banned. I do like Smite the Monstrous. This actually, this one has actually a ton of big creatures. Slash Panther, isn't that a vintage stable? love Abzan Guide. I'll take Throttle. I think Throttle's good. Some people don't. I think it's fine. There's so much removal in this form and it's really nice. Oh boy. I'll take a Siege. A rotting, a rotting Siege Mastodon.
with double pony back, I'm, I'm, I'm really in for this Rush of Battle here. I don't think we need a third Leaping Master. Rush of Battle is a great card. Debilitating Injury is great. CJ Harrier. I mean, Trump of Blast is basically a rush of battle for three, but. Barrage is actually a fine sideboard card. There's tons of decks where you can just like kill all their things. Gotta help my mom get a new TV. Hope you crush. I hope I do too. Man, Trail of Mystery is good. Sansep Citadel is basically just a Scoured Barrens that lets us maybe splash something if we really want to. If we have no plans to do so though, it's probably just better to take Windscarred Crag. I hate first picking a Windscarred Crag, but it is what it is. What can you do? Seeker of the Way is nice. It is a warrior too, which is weird because it looks pretty much like a monk to me. Looking real monk-like, Seeker of the Way. <sighs> Ideally, I can stop yawning. That would be fantastic. Zan Charm. Well, we didn't get the Alabaster Cairn in the last pack, but we do go in this pack. I think we've seen Jeskai Charm, Abzan Charm, and... Maybe that's it. I feel like there was one more charm. Like, look at this guy. He's literally a monk. If this guy is a monk, then this guy is a monk. And this is a Berserker. I'm like, that's weird, because, like, there's a... There's a warrior theme in this set, but, like, then you have this one random Berserker, and I'm like, well, but why? Armament Core? Oh, Marty Rough Rider is nice, though. I guess if we have to pick between one of these two uncommons, like, I'll, this one's a fine one to take. Another Pony Back and a Debilitating Injury? Probably going to lean towards Debilitating Injury here, rather than third Pony Back Brigade. Also, we have four lands here, which is super nice. <sighs> Excuse me, guys. I am tired today. If you had to be a cake, what type of cake would you be and why? Uh, this, is a, this is a weird question because would I be eating myself? Oh, this is just a guy charm. And another pony back? I'm going to take this Marty Horde Chief, though. That guy is that guy is on point. Making two warriors? This deck looks sweet so far. You're a cake. You have no mouth. <laughs> oh. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Mardu Ascendancy? What? This Ascendancy is actually nuts. Whenever a creature you control attacks, make a 1-1. One, one.
I have no mouth and I must eat. What is that from? That sounds like it's from something. Ankle Shanker too? Oh man, they're just setting us up here. I'm gonna take the end hostilities out. Oh yeah, we're gonna play this Angle Shanker. I'm gonna take this Venerable Lamasu out too, because that guy sucks butts. Wow, look at all these like this is that was a that was a nice seventh and eighth pick there. Jeez. I'm gonna take active treason. Salt Road Patrol, not terrible. Hey, this is crazy. My name is Mike B. I skip work daily. I guess we can take a tormenting voice here. I have no mouth and I must scream. That's what I'm thinking of. Yes. That's the name I'm thinking of. Okay. So we got to make one cut here. Could just be shambling attendance. Done. Man, Rough Rider, Anko Shanko, Devil Pony back, Mardu Ascendancy. Seems good. Mossy Beard, what's going on? Not to be confused with Mossy Bread. Okay. Oh, I'm yawning here, guys. I'm so sorry that you have to deal with my yawnitude. Okay. Definitely heavy white. These all cancel out. So five, six, seven, eight, five, six, seven, and then three, four, five, six, eight, seven, six. We have one double red, one double black. Six, seven, three, four, five, six. Eight, seven, six. I mean, that's, I think that's fine. It was my birthday yesterday because you weren't on until seven. I had to waste the day with my wife and Sean and Valtrex. Happy belated birthday, buddy. Really appreciate it. No, I don't. Wait, I don't appreciate your birthday. Uh, yes, I do. Happy birthday. That's all we're going to say here. Happy birthday, buddy. I'm so sorry I, I condemned you to such misery. I am like... I added the I appreciate it like you subbed or something, but I'm like, no, wait, that's not... That's not the normal. It's like when you go to a movie and they're like, enjoy the movie, and you're like, you too. And they're like, I'm working, you idiot. And I'm like, oh, no, he's right. He is working. Oh, we gotta get him. Oh no, he's right. I am an idiot. <laughs> what have I done? Thank you. Twister, thanks so much for the resub. Welcome back. Really appreciate it, buddy. Really appreciate it. I just had a huge bowl of potato soup and yawning is making me yawn. I'm going to fall asleep here at work. Me too, buddy. Me too. Nope, not going to do that. We're going to go one, two, three. Let's just draw, like, Ponyback Brigade into Windscarred Crag and then we can planes and flip. Is cake for dinner a bad or a good idea? It depends on how frequently you have it. If this, if it's just one time, that's fine. Um, I like. Okay. 
like as far as dinner goes i think you can pretty much eat whatever you want as long as it's within caloric with it within a caloric range that's healthy right like if you're eating like a four thousand calorie dinner probably bad no matter what it is if you're eating like one thousand calories or something like that's fine Also, I know, I'm not saying make a habit of it because you're still going to need nutrients, but. Good thing that roller derby 20 down the street has a tournament where the prize is exactly 900. I mean, this is just a help. This is just supplementing it. After this, you're going to go to the rent goal, so. Oh, I should have played Blood Flies first. Dang it. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter because it's not going to die. We're making this guy able to block, so. That's powerful. That's a powerful wizard spell. My board stayed disdainful stroke. Teamer trap essence. That's what I was thinking of. Whatever, dude. Whatever, you nerd. I'm running out of Mio's, guys. Stir this up a little bit. Ideos mio. Okay. We're doing it. We're waking up. The best part of waking up is cons of Tarkir in your cup. Cons of Oh, that was a good draw. Oh yeah, that guy's got to go. This guy, no Bloxies. You need more Mio? God, Kerwin, Kurt, Kurt, like, I'm gonna, I don't want to say yes and like have you just always send me things, but I mean, my answer is always going to be yes for like little things like that. I'm never going to be like, no, I'm good. I'm, yeah, I, I mean, I could always use more. It's my, it's my main source of, of beverages on stream. Also, I still have this one that's unopened from Kerwitz last, Kerwitz last purchase, which is a, it is a blueberry lemonade. And I'm hoping the blueberry component is not too strong. All right, we're just going to keep going, I guess. Do you have a hasty creature? Because this is lethal. You got to kill this guy, right? I was part of a stream the other day, and boy, is it hard to talk and play and keep up with chat. I have a whole new appreciation. Yeah, it's totally true. No one realizes that. Everyone's like, you're just playing Magic the Gathering for fun. And I'm like, okay, well, it's unfortunate that you think that, but there is a, it's difficult. Salt Road Petrol. And Leaping, this is going to be game. He says confidently, I mean, they can't cast Dune Blast or End Hostilities, and those are like the two sweepers in the format, so. WTF is Mio, is that just Crystal Light, but in a cool teardrop shape? It's, yeah, but it's like you can squeeze it into your drink. It's like a drink enhancer. It is a uh, liquid water enhancer, that's what it's called. It's sugar-free. Sugar-free. I don't know why I did that. Either way, I think our deck is good. I don't think we need to submit anything here. Yeah, that's just Crystal Light, but with less words. <laughs> How dare you. I don't think it has to do with you being a best multitasker, right? Like, it has to do with, like... It's just a different skill set. Like, it definitely takes time. Oh my god, Kerwit, thank you so much, dude. You are hilariously awesome. I appreciate you, my friend. I appreciate you. Kerwit's just like, I'm gonna send you some Mios. I like that Kerwit has uh, several good qualities. Generosity, a, dis a, a sizable disposable income, and uh, 
the convenience of Amazon Prime. Those three things make make Kerwitz friendship ultimately more rewarding. Oh, fashionably late, Mardu Hateblade. More like Mardu Late Blade. That's good. I like that. That was solid. JT, you said Frank Lepore is unbanned and hungry Howies. That's actually pretty hilarious. I'm just going to block here. If you have, like, the pump spell, it's fine. I'm not going to, like... I ain't scared of this Jeskai Elder. You ain't going to get no free hits in here, my dude. What do we do, though? I guess we... Oh, I guess we still attack, and then we just... I don't think they're blocking though because any any prow spell would, would spell doom it would spell doom can't believe you single with attributes like that no idea if you're single with her <laughs> like also if you did have those attributes I actually also can't that's why Frank is friends with me. My accessibility to Amazon Prime, my generosity and Chris, Chris is also extremely generous as, as far as friends go. What is this you're doing? So if you pump... Oh, God. I don't know what this is, but most of the morbs cost five. Except for this one. Oh, you're in a dragon scale boon? That's really good. Yeah, that's really good. Dragon Scale Boon ain't nothing to fuck with. It's like Wu-Tang Clan that way. I think we're just gonna keep Mardu. Or we're just gonna keep up Kill Shant. The best part of waking up is kill shot on your Jeskai Elder. Are you getting sick or just have a raspy voice from yelling at the stars every night? Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know actually. I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm getting sick. I didn't feel like my voice was raspy. Now I'm now I'm great. Now I'm self conscious. Thanks a lot, Mossy Beard. Dean from chat just sent me a, a message and he's like it's a picture of Sonny D and he's like I'm like nah man it will burn it'll burn your throat <laughs> oh Shut that's that's money. quality what's happening one rasp buck oh no now you're just emphasizing the raspiness them not having access to both blue and red at the same time is pretty good I think for us because it means they can't trap essence of us uh, they can do this though and kill our swarm. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. Best pair of big gear near. That better. I guess I can't block this guy. So now they can do. Now can now they can do all their trappy trappy essency things. Frank drank too much Sunny D and his throat is all burnt. Yeah, that's probably what it is, actually. It probably is Sunny D. Sunny D, the burnt throat. I think it's because I just haven't been sleeping well for the longest time. Did we just get our shank on? Like, we deal, what, two, three, four, five, six? It's not a ton. Could also play Salt Road and Mardu Hate Blade. Do a nap stream? Is that against the Twitch terms of service? Salty boys. And blady boys.
You made your hair Whoa! Well, something had to do it. Uh, actually, this is pretty good. I don't actually hate this. Well, our guys can't block this turn, so we'll just take seven and go to nine. What is Sunny D exactly? Are, Tim, are you from Germany? Or do you just live there currently? They have one card in hand. Fascinating. Interesting. Born in Berlin. And you just got named Tim, huh? That's such a... That's such a that feels like such a non-German name. Is that true? Is that not a German name? I don't know. with the hero we need linking sunny d in the chat to uh to tim uh i think we keep this guy back interesting is tim is common in germany that is crazy i would have not have guessed that but i mean like also i'm not super familiar with the the etymology of german names so Are they gonna oh they're they're trapped. They're gonna their last card was trap essence and they're just trying to figure out what they're gonna put it on. Yeah, it seems good. Put it on this guy, it's a two turn clock. Well, they did not trap essence that, so I guess. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's just do it. Let's just alpha. It's a two-turn clock. I mean, if they have something, they have something, right? Like, I felt like we were way ahead in this match, and then I felt like this barrage of boulders turned things around a little bit. We can still just attack with this guy and, like, keep everybody else back. This guy's not a great blocker. This guy's not a great blocker on this board. The only thing we have to block is this. So I could... Salt Road Patrol is, like, the only card... Oh. What? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... But then, like, you have two blockers next turn. I guess they're not great blockers, but still. I mean, you still had a draw? That was weird. I did not think we were just going to flat out win that. It's basically orange drink. <laughs> Yeah, it's like it's like an it's like it wants to be orange juice, but it's kind but it's it's like if orange juice was made by a soda company without carbonation. So literally like Fanta without the gas. Yeah, perfect. That's a perfect description. But also it's like it it burns your throat. <laughs> Sunny D, it'll burn your throat. So, you know. Is Fanta even a thing? Yeah, it is. We have a thing called ICP, which is the insane clown posse. And they have a thing called Juggalos, which is their their fans. Their fans are known as Juggalos. And uh, for some reason, that whole thing has latched onto Fanta as like the, the default beverage. I will keep this hand. Um, excuse me, they do not like, don't they? What do you mean, they do not like Fanta? I thought they loved, they like Fago. Oh, they like Fago, you're right. Wow, I'm gonna get roasted, guys. You guys are gonna be like, the YouTube comments are gonna be like, this fucking idiot thinks. Excuse me, you think Juggalos like fa Fanta? Oh my god. And then they're like, unsubscribed, idiot. And I would be like, oh god, I'm sorry. I would my my kingdom for a for a land here. New question: What's Fago? <laughs> it's like Fanta, only different. 
Well, we did not get the land we needed. But this guy having to attack every turn is great for us because that means it can never block. Frank, you ignorant slut. What is that from? That's from something. Well, I like this better when I actually had lands. I respect you more for getting that wrong. Nailed it. Oh, I, I heard the, you know, the juggalos, they like Fanta or something. I don't know, man. I don't really keep track. Come on. Any basic land other than swamp. One time. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> obnoxious i want to just keep this guy because next turn we get to play ideally if we draw land we get to play mardu ascendancy come on man i just went to the fago website which linked to spotify page of theirs which was 404 and thanks Jugg thanks a lot juggalos Sunny D ain't noise pollution. Wait, it worked. Wait a minute, it worked. By Jove, I think he's got it. Well, this guy's real problematic now, because now we're going to draw the land we need, which we did. And even if we play Mardu Ascendancy, we're not going to be able to really do much. Missing two land drops in this match was really problematic. I just block here and, and block here, I guess. Take two. It's not great. Fanta was invented by a German during a trade embargo with Nazi Germany because they couldn't get the Coca-Cola syrup imported. That's interesting. That is a fun fact. That's a fun fact. I had a good time. I like when people say fun fact and they tell you something that's kind of boring and you're like, that wasn't fun at all. Oh, this is an interesting block. Fun fact. I ate pizza for lunch. See, that's not a fun fact. I didn't have a good time. In fact, you might say I had a bad time. Three, four, five, six, seven. Do I want to go to seven here? Probably not. Do I have anything to even play next turn? No. Uh, I mean, if we draw a land, flipping flipping this would be great, but also like we can just play Martyr Rough Rider. We have to look at the situation where we don't draw the land. We draw the land. Okay, so we can play Rough Rider. As your producer, that was a fun fact. Please be fun. Actually, I just heard from uh, Nifty Chris that uh, when you said you had uh, pizza for lunch, I had a good time. I want to thank you for sharing. Actually, just because this guy has to attack. Cancel. Come on back. Come on back. Block you, block you. Guys, I'm having a really good time. Thanks to uh, thanks to Baller Donk having pizza for lunch. You just got produced. He's right, I did get produced. Dang. I feel like we actually have to be a little aggressive here. My, I forgot to mention my mom actually peed me about that post. She was like, Christopher, are you moving to Florida? <laughs> That's hilarious. And you should be like, yeah, mom, I got a job. I'm a big time producer in Florida. I'm a big time producer, mom. Let's use the most expensive part of the buffalo and see if they just counter it. You got to cancel? You got to cancel it? No, you didn't do anything. 
You didn't do anything. It's pretty good. Let's get in there with just this guy. I'll choose you. They have three cards. We have a blocker, and they didn't have a removal spell last turn, right? Maybe they did. I don't know, man. This game is going to be close. Do we just play the Kirin? If they counter the Kirin... See, we could just keep up kill shot. I'm a Kirin it. Okay, we Kirin it. Oh god, they have something. This is my concern. I gotta kill two blockers. Oh, see, this is why we should have kept up kill shot. Now we're dead. We actually could have used this. Oh, we have six. We totally threw this game away in two different ways right there. Oh, it's infuriating. Ugh. Yeah, that was bad. Wow, I was like, what could go wrong? And then literally everything that could go wrong went wrong. I was so stupid. I'm a, such a bad, I'm such a bad magic player. But see, I'm focusing on the Florida move, and I'm focusing on Nifty Chris, and then you have pizza for lunch, and I'm so excited about it because I'm having a good time. There's so many things going on. It's hard to feel bad that you lose a match of Magic the Gathering online. And by match, I mean game. And I'll keep this hand. I was. I was so focused on Fago that I couldn't even concentrate. Once he gets that Fago in him, he's like... It's basically a maniac. Are they playing two colors? Are they playing two color like red-blue? I, li I actually like that because it triggers this guy. I want to get rid of planes here. It's a gamble. Shut up and take my money. Gratuitous products. The Franklin the Poor Show is brought to you by the delicious taste of hot dog sandwiches. Now with flavor. Why is my name spelled incorrectly? Either way, thank you, Gratuitous Products. Really appreciate you. Every time there's a there's a donation like that, I just always assume it's Kerwit. Sure. No? They said no, I'm good. Do you think after we get a Hungry Howie sponsorship we can work towards Fago? That would then that would get us them LaCroix bucks. <laughs> Who's Kerwit? Excuse me? Why that's you, silly. They should put people who enjoy Fago and people who enjoy the career together in a stadium and have them all fight to the death. Wow. That's aggressive. I don't want to get in there with the master. I think we're just going to already rough rider here. That's rude. God, I can't believe we lost that game because of our own stupid idiot. Like, if we just keep up kill shot, the only thing we have to do, we have to deal with both counter spell and a removal spell, otherwise they really can't win. Okay, well, this... I feel like our deck is way better. I mean, we just definitely misplayed in game one, for sure. For sure. For make sure. Is Barrage of Boulders very good? What do we see? Like, what's up? Why do we have one toughness? Like, we only saw the, the, the Leaping Master. Fago and LaCroix are made by the same company. I'm gonna mold this hand. Eh, I'll keep this hand. What are we getting rid of here? Swamp, I guess? Dunzo and the Bunzo. Shut up and take my money. Oh, okay. Fay Croy, one dollar. Fay Croy, the new drink for juggalettes. <laughs> oh god. We would have also accepted Lego. 
I've heard about this new White Claw stuff that's basically alcoholic. Or I've also heard of White Claw. It'll break your brain. None of the people drink LaCroix are like Juggalo Light. Drinking LaCroix, it'll break your brain. I thought we mulliganed this. No, we mulliganed the land. Are they, they're just blue red. I guess we'll just play this guy. I hate not getting my token, but yeah, barrage would have been good here for sure. <clears throat> oh, I see, Mantis Rider, eh? Just that hot, gentlemen? Okay. No, I'm a bony back, bony back, bony back. <coughs> Excuse me. Or don't. Totally up to you guys. I'm not your dad. Act of treason. Oh, butter my biscuits. What are you doing here? Feet of resistance? Oh, God. God, we killed us and we're still dead. Oh my god, losing that first game was so brutal. Ugh, so sad. I, I, I have no one to blame but myself. Rogue Optic. Dev, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Oh, are you going to see Iron Man tonight? That's pretty sick, man. I'm a big Tony Stark fan. Iron Maiden sounds sick, dude. I would love to see Iron Maiden. It's so funny, like, the large chunk of time that bands like that have been around. Like, Iron Maiden's got to be around for, like, 40 years. And it's so weird because you're like, wow, they're still touring. They almost feel like, it almost feels like, not even like a band, like a, a group of human beings that play in a band. It almost feels like an idea. Like, oh, I'm going to go see, I'm going to see the the idea Iron Maiden for the fourth time tonight. Because there's no way that you could have been touring in like 1970 and also 2019. You know what I mean? Like, it's just a crazy. When did Iron Maiden form? Uh... 1975 yeah so it's crazy to think that iron maiden was turning probably like 1977 let's say and also in 2019 that's just such a wide range of of time that it's almost surreal it's like those people who are like let's say you're 40 in 1975 and you're seeing iron maiden god you would have been born in like 1935 people born in 1935 could have seen iron maiden live and people who were born in like 2000 one can see Iron Maiden live. Like, that's insane, dude. Isn't that crazy, though? I mean, you can see Iron Maiden when you're 50, right? Like, if you were born in 1925, and you're 50 years old, and it's 1975, and you go see Iron Maiden, people born in 1925 could see the same band live that people in 20... In, that were born in 2001 could see. Isn't that crazy? I just can't even imagine that. Like, that's so mind-blowing to me. <laughs> hey, weren't you born in 1925? You saw Iron Maiden 2? Yeah, that's cool. Frank realizes how crazy the passage of time... What a crazy time. 
I think we're just playing this. Like, we don't have any... We're not going to keep up kill shot. We could, I could kill shot this block here. But then we have nothing to do next turn, whereas, like, now... I still guess we're going to do next turn. I really need someone else to be like, yes, Frank, that's totally insane. That people in 1925 and 2001, people born in these times, could could both see the same bands. Like, that's insane to me. I'm like... I think that Keith is singing that long as to not drink Sunny, three, Sunny D. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, you don't want to go on stage and be like, oh, my throat really burns, guys. I can't really perform tonight. Okay, bear with me here, but here's another thing like that. Oh, look, see, we played this, and now we get to play Kieran. Pia and Kieran. Alabaster Kieran Nalar. And they're going to be like, Trap Essence, because everyone fucking Trap Essence is me. Oh, I guess it's just a stainful stroke. Sure. I went and saw the specials a few years ago. That's pretty similar, although I think there's only two to the original of 1977. Are all of the Iron Maiden members of the original? No blocks again. This was Frank's daily reminder that time marches inevitably onward towards all of our demises. Guys, just so you know, the lesson here today is that time is a, is a flat circle. Oh, I hate this guy. I hate this guy. I hate... I really want to draw land here so we can resolve one of these five drops. One time. Why do you hate me? Why do you hate me? I'm going to get rid of Smite here. A little magic. And they have a third guitarist who they ever fired after the original came back. So that's amazing. Like, original guitarist leaves. They're like, yeah, let's get this new guy in here. And then the original guitarist is like, hey, man, I want to play with you guys. And you're like, yeah, cool, but Steve's got to stay. And he's like, yeah, that's cool. That's that's actually hilarious. Yeah, world's ugliest man. I'm like, come on, dude. <laughs> come on, bring it. That's sick because it's just like another, another, like, like, a, just another level, right? It's like now instead of a two-guitar band, you're a three-guitar band. Or, you know, however many however many Iron Maiden has, I'm actually not entirely positive. Oh, I hate that they have Disdainful Stroke because I want to resolve both of these. Sorry, it's long. That's what she... <laughs> God damn. God damn. We're in round three and it's only 58 minutes. See, cons of Tarkir drafts really go fast too, which is super nice. Because if you're watching these on YouTube, it's very easy to digest. And the other thing is, if you guys are watching on YouTube and you you haven't subscribed over on Twitch, feel free to check out patreon.com slash franklapore. I don't produce a ton of content there, but it's a great way to su support the content I do produce on like YouTube or cool stuff. And if you guys want to donate like one or two dollars a month, it's a lot simpler than, than Twitch. All right, I'm going to block... This guy's always a 2-2. This guy's... Alright, this is fine. We're gonna pump. So we know they have Disdainful Stroke and two other cards. They're probably gonna Windmill Slam like a Sagu Mauler and we're gonna be like, Wish I had my Hate Blade. Actually, at 17, we probably just could've taken it and then saved that for a future when we have like Swarm of Blood Flies. Yeah, that's fine. I don't really care about that. But they do awkwardly have Disdainful Stroke still. Yeah, I'm just going to pass here and I'm going to kill shot this guy. Equal to or less than the number of Slipknot guitarists? Um, yeah, definitely less than. I think Slipknot has like 17 guitarists. I think the hardest part for Slipknot is finding that many masks. How about a pig mask? Oh, you already got a pig mask. Dang it. All right. How about like a zipper mask? Now we got that one too. Shit. God, where do we find this 12th mask? Are you still right around 500? No, I am like... <laughs> I don't even want to talk about it. Stop keeping disdainful stroke up. Oh, man. I mean, I'm just going to play this guy. If they disdain it, that's fine. And we can get Bloodfell Caves next turn. 
Yep, you got it. Because then we can write next turn. We can take four here. I think we're still fine. Like, Mardu, Mardu Rough Rider is good. And if we do ever give it uh, lifelink with a Russia battle, it's good. Alger Hiss was a lawyer who was charged with espionage. And Alger or Alger, it doesn't, I'm not sure it matters. And he was a major target of Nixon when Nixon was in Congress. In the 1920s, Hiss worked as a law clerk for Supreme Court Justice Oliver Wendell Holmes. Uh, when he was a clerk, Holmes told his stories that Holmes had heard from his grandmother about her living in Boston when the Revolutionary War broke out and her looking out the window as a little kid watching Red Coat. That's insane. It's insane that you can connect, like, Nixon with, um, you know, the Revolutionary War with, like, two people. You know what I mean? Oh, wow. We're just going to draw mono removal here. Um... So if we play this, we're taking seven, right? Because we're not going to block either of these. So I think we're actually just going to right of the serpent. This guy. Hope you don't have disdainful... Oh, you have no cards in hand. So in that room in the 1920s, you had a conversation between two people whose memories stretched all the way from the revolution to Watergate. Yeah, that's insane. That's really, like... It's hard to, like, take anything... It's hard to, like... I'm taking things away from that, but I'm not sure actually what they are. Like, it's really, like, it's it's humbling in a sense. In a way, you're like, wow, time is, you know, it's a small world and time is, like, we're here for a while, you know what I mean? We can take three, go to six. Play Horde Chief. Take another three, go to three. Play Rush. And then probably gain a million if they haven't drawn like a counter spell or a solid removal spell. And that's what we're banking on here. That's even better because now we get to play two things. Holmes was a soldier for the Union in the Civil War and he was shot three times. Oh my god. This story just keeps getting wackier. Like, the connections with that many, like, major historical events is crazy. Nailed it. Alright, so as long as they don't have, like, Lightning Bolt, which I don't think there is in this format. They could have, like, plus three, plus three and Trample, I guess, but... <laughs> There's Arrow Storm. Womp womp. I guess that's a good point. God, if I lose to the Arrow Storm that I didn't even remember had the ability to go at faces, I'm going to cry. I will cry. I feel like this rusher battle is going to have to bring us back here. All right, that's a life point. No counterspell. Let's know a situation if they have a counterspell. We're just dead, right? Like if they have disdainful stroke number two as their card, like. Um, let's get this two toughness guy out of the way. Because I don't really want them to trade here. I'd rather just have all my guys live. This is also 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. This is 14 life. So they go to 1 here. <laughs> We're at 18. Yeah. Yeah. Badger, what's going on, buddy? Was that a trooper by Iron Man? Yes, I've been I've been humming the trooper because of uh because Dev is going Dev uh Rogue Optic is going to Iron Maiden soon. I feel like they're going to concede here. That's my guess. Oh, incremental growth, huh? 6, 10, 13. 
Incremental growth is utterly insane. So the thing is, if they do have plus three, plus three, if their hand is literally incremental growth plus three, plus three, if they drew the nut, we win. Okay. Arrow Storm just goes to the face. Yeah, I think we're good. Our deck seems sweet, and I think our loss came... I mean, our loss was our own fault. The opening band is the son of the bassist. That's how you know you've been touring for a long ass time because you're, you're, you're literally your kids are now having their own bands on tour with you. Oh yeah, snap keep, snap ems, make keep ems done. Plus two, plus I would have done it? I don't think so. I think we would have been at two. I think we were at 18 and they had 14 power. They had six, six, and four, right? So that was 12, 13, 14. Oh, no, no, you're right. You're right. <clears throat> What's plus two, plus O, though? What even is that? I don't think there's a card. I think Trumpet Blast is like the only thing that could have done that. Hey, funny story. I discovered I'm lactose intolerant. Badger, we just discussed earlier before you got here, I think, um, that sometimes when people say funny story, the stories aren't actually funny. That doesn't sound funny at all. That sounds terrible. I'm so sorry, buddy. By discovered, you mean like it happened recently? Like recently you realized you were, like you just weren't able to process it? Also, I'm feeling much more awake now. I don't know what happened, but I got my second wind. I think it was just... I was drinking this this great value uh, cherry limeade. Uh, this this generic Walmart brand Mio. And it says, energy, caffeine, and vitamins B3, B6, and B12. And I'm like, okay, cool. Sunny D, it'll burn your throat. Rampaging Ferocidon is unbanned, for, which is weird because like it rotates in 46 days. So it's like... Hey guys, here's like a month and a half of Rampaging Frostodon. Enjoy. I'm almost tempted to use this and attack for five, but that doesn't really do anything. I tried cutting milk, cheese, etc. out of my diet. I feel better. Oh, that's awesome. Can you go to like a doctor and, and, and check and see if that's what it actually is? I feel like you've been feeling crap, like feeling crap for years and you have... Um, What's it called? National healthcare? Universal healthcare? Like, just go to the doctor and be like, hey, am I lactose intolerant? Oh, appointment is made to confirm it. Oh, sweet. So you already had me. Nicely done, sir. I hope, I hope, <clears throat> while it sucks, so here's the thing, it sucks that you wouldn't be able to eat dairy, but it also, it's awesome that you would actually know. You're like, okay, well, cool. Now I know. All right, we're going to get in here with this. If they block, we're going to throttle. If they don't, we're going to play Marty Rough Rider. And they're just going to Disdainful Stroke it, so. So maybe we just play Swarm instead. I know you just got your second win because of my amazing history lesson. I mean, that definitely didn't hurt. <clears throat> For sure. I love it when the, yeah, I really, one of my, my favorite things is like when the chat gets on a little tangent. And like we just start talking about other cool stuff. That's entertaining. When did you start feeling like crap, sir? Uh, joke's on you, Doc. I've always felt like crap. Oh, I see. Get him. Get him. Is this a insect warrior? No, just a regular insect. Well, biscuits. So three, four, five, six, seven. Let's see if we're dead. Actually, maybe we just play two guys.
Yeah, this seems safer, and then next turn Rush of Battle seems real good. I mean, we only get lifelink on here, but still. It's still five. Five life. Plus a lot of damage, so... Everybody have fun tonight. Everybody block some tonight. Okay, this is four four now. Are they gonna go? Are they gonna go planes and hostilities? Hey, Rock, have some money, Badger. Thank you so much, buddy. I really appreciate it. I don't even know if I finished my thought. I think I was saying that like, it sucks that you have to like go to the like. It sucks if you can't eat milk and cheese, but it's nice to know. I think that's what I was gonna say, and I'm not sure if I finished actually saying it. Like, it's good to be like, okay, now I know what's wrong, and I can just avoid that. Like, it's not easy to do, necessarily, but it's... I think it's rewarding to... To just be able to know. I don't know. Badger, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. I did finish my train of thought. That's good. So, I just repeated myself. Dude, you are awesome. I really appreciate you. You are my favorite. Shut up and take my money. Oh god. Oh god, this is big. This is a woolly loxodon, just hard cast. Oh jeez. Oh god, what's happening? Oh god, I'm gonna vomit. Well, I guess we're dead. I feel like I should have killed this like 10 years ago. It's, I'm so annoyed with myself. Why am I even doing this? Because I'd rather not right click and concede. I'll just let it... Oh, it's so annoying. Today I will design a sword deck and stand with Frost on. You have to play it. Oh, deal. I almost like Sage Eye Harrier just because it blocks a stupid bird, but I don't think we care about the bird that much. Oh, God. I feel like all these games have been so close. I also feel like I've mulliganed a lot like this. Ugh, whatever. Just for Austin and then 56 lands. I mean, technically, that's a dinosaur deck. What's the theme of your deck? Uh, di dinosaurs, basically. MTGA doesn't get the banning until next Wednesday. I just play it on. I'll just play it on Magic Online. Because I don't want to be crafting. I don't want to craft. Uh, what's it called? I don't want to craft rampaging Ferocidons anyway, and be like, hey, here's my, here's my rampaging for. I'm going to play these for 46 days. Kintry Warden face down. Face up. <sighs> Hold on a second.
Hit me with your best shot. Come on, hit me with your best shot. I can't wait for the cube to start having an awful time doing core 2020 drafts and standard. Um, yeah, I can't wait for the cube this Wednesday either. Even though it's, it's just Grixis cube, it looks pretty sweet. I haven't seen the list, obviously, but I mean, the idea of a Grixis cube sounds pretty sweet. I bet there's all the nickel boluses. Oh God, that guy's big. This is a situation where I actually don't even want you to have. Ugh, God. I don't even want you to have vigilance here because you're just a liability now. I went into a pet shop and asked, oh, this is going to be a, this is going to be a goddamn dad joke, isn't it? 12 bees. The shopkeeper counted out 13 and handed them over. You're giving me one too many. That one is a freebie. Do, 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 Am I really that predictable? Yes. I mean, when it comes to, when it comes to dad jokes, yes, 100%. I went into, as long as I was like, I went into a pet shop, I was like, this dude did not go into a pet shop. There's no way Badger went into a pet shop. This is not a thing that happened in real life. So we traded our five drop for their five drop. There's a rare. I think that's actually fine. Okay, they're just playing a bunch of Dirtles, which is okay. Let's get busy shanking. My girlfriend changed a lot since she became vegan. It's like I've never seen her before. <laughs> Oh dear God, dear God, it's weird because it's this, it's this, it's this really weird combination of pride and disappointment at the same time. Like, boy, I'm so proud of you, buddy, but also I'm so sad. As soon as space travel is possible, moving from the Milky Way to the Soy Milky Way galaxy, I'm galactose intolerant. That's actually fantastic. I'm 100% not blocking this, this team or snow beast. If they want to spend their turn flipping it, that's fine. Hmm. I'm a fan of that guy. Sunny day and I'm burning for food. Man, first strike and death touch is no joke. Oh god, is it Oh god, come on. Sure. Why not tap this guy? You can still get a blocker out of the way. 
What do I know? Should have played. Should have played black instead. Mardu hate the blade. I know the flag is a big plus. Wow. Wowie, Kazawi. Oh, hi, Spire Manty Boy. One, two, three, four. We're one man away from actually rushing and floating this guy. Smiting the monsters, huh? The first week was the hardest. Wow, dude. Jeez. Oh, dear God. Um, none of you guys are smiteable. It's quite sad. I mean, if we do this, they just like trade with like smoke teller, or they even just block and pump. Oh yeah, Badger has a million dad jokes. It's unbelievable. I feel like we're going to lose this game, and I don't like it. I mean, double blocking, I guess, is a thing. And just hoping that the two cards in their hand aren't going to blow us out in some way. Like, if they have a pump spell, I wish we had one more mana for smite, but... Okay. That's, that's a great trade. I'm okay with that. Don't barrage me, bro. Sure. Saltai Flea. Another creature that does not have power four or greater. Oh, Scarab Barons. I'd love to get in there for two, but then, like, I guess we take this guy down, and I take three, four, five, six. I just don't feel like that's a good trade. I don't think we have any good trades, to be honest with you. Maybe we do it anyway. Because, like, next turn we can rush a battle and pump this guy. Attack with everything, I'm sure. Oh, really? I mean, I don't know what this morph is. I, I was assuming it was Teamer Snow, Snow Treader, whatever that guy is. But... Yeah, I think we're dead here. Well, that's good. Well, that's good, too. I mean, now I'll trade for sure. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but... Yeah, all right. I feel like we're actually not doing terribly here. This this is the turn they have to flip it, right? Like, if we just don't have anything to do against it, they're going to get five damage in. All right, let's see it. Still nothing. Is it Karu's Spell Snatcher? No, they're going to flip it now. And Teamer Snowhorn Rider, yep. I mean, we could just block here. I think taking three is fine. 
Of course, if they have incremental growth, then we're dead again. Like, they just go plus three, plus two, plus one, and then they kill us. I don't know. I mean, I, if they have incremental growth, we're just chump blocking anyway, so I don't really feel like it puts us in a winning position. So, I think Ponyback Brigade is what we really want to draw here. <laughs> Fantastic. And we play around Disdainful Stroke by just putting it face down. And you have Trap Essence, because they always have Trap Essence. How many fucking Trap Essences do I have to play against? It's unbelievable. That's really frustrating. I'd actually feel like I could race if this was a warrior and I could gain life, but apparently only some of the monks are actually warriors and some are not, so... Oh, boy. Was it an all-star card in Contraft? That was not my impression. I, I was I never felt like it was an all-star. Yep, and that's the end. All right. 1-2, unfortunately. Not an ideal record. Not what we were hoping for. One of the losses was definitely to our own our own folly but here we are thank you guys for watching slam those like and subscribe buttons check me out on twitch on patreon uh on manatraders.com and coolstuffinc.com all of those links are in the description below and those are great ways to support the stream or the, or the youtube channel if you guys are watching there thank you so much and i'll see you next time